Hey, Geminis. This is going to be a general for the rest of March. Okay, so if you have Gemini anywhere in your chart, this reading is for you. Cross watchers are welcome. All right, so let's get into it. Some of y'all may be receiving something that could balance a few things out. Okay, some type of investment is paying off or some work or time, effort, and energy you put into something is paying off. You could be at a crossroads about what to put your time, effort, and energy into. Okay, somebody could be coming in, uh, giving you some love or giving you something that you love. Gemini. Could be an earth sign or a Gemini. Virgo here with the hermit energy coming out. Death, Scorpio coming out. Somebody wants to stop being alone. Uh, but they are, I'm feeling like somebody is resisting. Doing this. Somebody is being cold. Or they're trying to figure out what action they want to take. <laughs> okay, but there is somebody here that's very wise, very knowledgeable. They know a lot. Somebody here has been through a transformation. Okay, so somebody here could have ended it with an earth sign. I'm seeing that too. Capricorn is coming up as well. Somebody here is blocking out negativity. Okay, that's this trying to come their way or they're sending it back. They're fighting it off. Yeah, somebody could be breadcrumbing you, Gemini. Just feeding you a bunch of lies, causing um, depression or mental conflict here. Let me use this other deck. Who do deck? Being slick at the mouth. Somebody knows it's going to take a person a while to uh, stop being toxic. I'm getting somebody here likes to hurt people's feelings. Now, on the other hand, somebody here is very intuitive and they know the truth. Something could take up to seven years or took up to seven years or prolonged over seven years. I'm getting that. Some of y'all dealing with the water sign for real. Aquarius also is here. So you're resisting a relationship because on your end, um, your family could be like, this is not the person for you. Okay. But somebody on your side is like, you know, you know, or your family or your people that support you or whatever, they know this is not for you. On the other end, this the person, they family could be like, you need to deal, you need to talk to that person. You need to get back right with this person. I'm seeing that going. I'm seeing that happening. It's like two different pages here. Yeah, Pisces is here as well. This person here, somebody here is stuck in their ego. They don't know how to move on. Somebody here is very smart. Like I said, somebody knows a person is breadcrumbing them. And this is over. I got the queen of pentacles and the, and the devil twice. Somebody here knows that something needs to be over. Because after all this time, it's just too toxic. Somebody is manipulative, very deceptive. Trickery at its finest. Somebody could be asking for a second chance, but you can either you can't see clearly what this person's intentions or motives are, or this is just how they are. They're lying about it, or they're or they're making something seem a certain way that is not going to be. They want to keep you stagnant because they want you to continue to put effort and energy into them. Somebody here could be receiving a gift from an older individual. Um, there's an ending to a commitment unless there, unless some change actually happens. I don't see you giving back to this. Somebody could resisting, could be resisting a relationship because they don't have enough finances. They don't have enough money. Okay. They could be blocking you out. 
because they could be dealing with somebody else that could be giving them this. Yeah, somebody is false. They're lying about who they're dealing with. They could be dealing with two other people. Very cold towards you, though. But in the background, somebody going to be coming in towards you. Somebody is going to be coming towards you. Or you could be keeping your little stuff to the side, whatever you're doing, because you're like, I don't have time to deal with this toxicity. You're trying to manipulate me. It's not working, though. I'm sleeping peacefully at night. That's what, that's what uh, Gemini is saying. Or cross watcher. Because there is some change coming in towards you in the distant horizon. Somebody here has manifested a new place, a new environment to the point. Okay, this is what I'm saying. Somebody has invested. I said invested. They have manifested a new envir environment a new, or a new place that this person couldn't even get a get in if they tried, if they tried to. This person can't even get in there. They want you to think they're official when they're not. They want to call all the shots. Somebody here could be offering up. They could be saying they want to be married to you. But how? They trapped within themselves. They can't even they don't even know who they are. This person does not even know who they are. You're going towards something more official, Gemini. Point blank period. This person is lying. Take care. Enemies are working against you. They're just not telling the truth. I don't even know if they know how to. You're going on a path of success. So please do not lower your standards. Don't be tempted to lower your standards with this individual. Something could have took place in November. Okay. Or you could be meeting a new person born in November. Why is false person here? This person could be lying about a position. Excuse me. You could be uh, waiting for some news to come in. Or they could have told you they're waiting on some news to come in. They straight up lied. They're not waiting on no, they're not waiting on any news to come in. Rat. Rat came out. Because some of y'all dealing with a rat. They sneaking trying to see, like, they trying to hide that they are stalking to see what you're doing. They're going to go through frustration because your wishes are being granted. I'm seeing that. You're in a different role, Gemini. Financial increases. So you're going to you're going to receive something good that is going to come in. Okay, so I got financial gain and I have the increase. Some excitement is here. The temptation cards on the other side, like I said, there is going to be some temptation. Somebody's going to try to tempt you. For some of y'all, it's going to be an easy no blocked out. For some of y'all, y'all going to have to work a little bit harder to get this person off of you. Okay, I do see you seeing through the illusions. Okay, y you are getting recognition. I am seeing that something is going in your favor, like a decision is being made for something to go in your favor where something is going to pay off in November or it did. You're very clear um, on what's going on at this point. Your intuition told you what was happening. Okay. You're moving on. You're moving forward, Gemini. Your intuition told you something needed to be over. Point blank, period. This person looking at you like, wow, I thought I was going to marry that person. 
You said, no. Mm -mm. They looked at you like uh, somebody to settle down with. Or somebody looked at a person as somebody to settle down with. And this person straight up was like, nope, they switched up. They changed up. Like, I'm not marrying you. You're a whole rat. Like, I look at you as a, in disgust. The Queen of Pentacles blocked this person out. Mm -hmm. And they decided to put their effort, time, and energy into something else. And I feel like I, I think I said it in the beginning of the reading. They said, I'm blocking this negativity out. No longer being manipulated by this person that's imprisoned themselves. And I want, I will not be imprisoned in my own home. Some of y'all had to learn a hard lesson dealing with this person too. They were abusive with the devil and the king of swords. Sharing with everybody with lies. Wearing a mask. Taking their time. Bread. They were breadcrumbing you. They was definitely communicating with other people or taking action towards other people. Making people think that they were like this big boss or so official here. So let's see what advice do, um, that you have or what energy you need to be embodying. You need to surrender to a rebirth. And follow your intuition, Gemini, because it's, it's right on point. Whoever this reading is for, do not be ashamed. Don't be ashamed that you got to start it over. Sometimes we have to learn lessons and we have to find the lessons in the situations that we go through. The lessons and the losses that we take. So when you really look at it, it's not really a loss. You really just leveled up if you learned the lesson. As soon as I said it, the level up card came out. So let's see what energy you need to be embodying. The truth, the naked truth need to come out. Some of y'all got two people, two options. Open up your options. Know you good enough to have options. You need to make some choices that need to be made. And you do not self-sabotage things. At the bottom of the deck is miracles. Because that's what it's going to feel like it's happening. Or that's what has been feeling like is going on with you ever since you cut ties from this person. You cut the cords with this person. It's a new season. It's a new day. You combine the energy of um, feeling stagnant. All that past energy that you had to withhold. Being with this person, you let all of it, you, you let it go from being out of a relationship with this person. But you put it into something that is creating like something big. Bigger than you could imagine. Mm-hmm. I am seeing somebody here thinking about doing some cosmetic stuff. Cosmetic surgery or something like that. You need to make a decision and stop self-sabotaging. Like some of y'all are wanting to go into something. But you are self-sabotaging going into it. You're taking your little time to take the action to go towards this. But this is what's going to give you that gain that you're looking for. Show, do what it is you want to do. Go full-fledged and stop holding yourself back because you're feeling like, well, maybe I'm not going to be able to do it or maybe it's not going to turn out this way. Go through the processes and learn the lessons that you need to learn so that you can grow into something big. Don't be afraid to because you're going to stay stagnant and you're not going to be able to acquire the stuff that you're looking for. Not in that mindset. All right, so Gemini, these were your messages. If this reading resonated with you, please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you later.